Hello everyone, it's me, JSKB, and welcome to Raven's Point Basement Demo. And this video is going to be one of those three games, one video type dealios. Just, just giving you a heads up because I'm... I'm trying to change things. <laughs> Actually, I don't know. I don't know. I just I just feel like doing stuff. I haven't, I haven't uploaded in a little bit, so I, I want to knock out more indie games in one video. So um, I got a lot to fucking catch up on, plus a new game jam just came out. So there's going to be a lot of game uploads. So Raven's Point Basement Demo. Some of you guys may have seen me play this on stream. Uh, I just played it for a little Listen bit. Holy shit. Up. That is loud. There's one in this room. There's one in this room. As you turn on the lights, you will cross over and meet it. It wants you to play a game. It's going to hide in the room, and you must find it. It has a talisman. Follow his laughter when it hides, and you will find him. Then. It's your turn to hide. It will hunt you down, but do not run away from it. Wait for it to get close, and listen for its laughter. Your mind is the safest place you can hide, Sarah. When you hear its laughter, close your eyes, and do not open them until it leaves. The cycle will repeat, and it will lose strength every time, until the tether breaks. Do not let it win. I will help you, Sarah. Okay, so, um, this game is like a boss rush kind of game. Uh, just released... So it's still the demo. Obviously, this is the basement demo. So the basement, I'm assuming, is going to be like level one, and then it'll branch out from then. Uh, I think that's all I wanted to say. I can't remember. So I got new journal entries. Like I said, I played it a little bit on the stream. I feel like I get it a little more now. So uh, let's see. Uh, left mouse button and rat. F for flashlight. Space for space bar. <laughs> space for <laughs> space bar. Uh, to close your eyes. Shift to sprint. Tab for inventory. Escape to pause. And listen carefully. There's ones. Okay, so I got to turn on the light. Uh, to trigger things so I've got to find the light this is a pretty ass game though by the way uh, left mouse to take right to put oh see it even tells you okay cool so we got shit going on what's that um he coming after you don't scream just close your eyes okay and we got some notes what do these notes say I can't read them that says you can cool your bed warm hands down over to your left Reminder, tell Derek he's bad. Uh, beware of Omen. Uh, <laughs> rip Stefan Carl Stephenson. 821-2018, forever number one. Aw, that's probably a real person. Aw, uh, rip, I'm sorry. I'm sorry you lost your friend, developer. I'm assuming that's what that is. Unless it's a joke, which I, I'm not going to joke about that. And we got a shopping list. We got some photos. It's pretty cool. These assets look pretty original. Like, I haven't, I don't think I've seen this stuff maybe it's just me i don't know fuck it <laughs> who knows man uh well, we got some drawers oh we can look inside oh what's that uh it's like a gamepad it is gamepad okay tab for inventory gamepad a generic off-brand gamepad made of cheap plastic it probably doesn't even work why did i pick this up i don't know <gasps> why did you pick the what's that oh my god Eww. okay cool a uh, creepy bunny. It's a weird bloodied bunny doll. I don't remember owning this. It looks handmade. Wait. So are there collectibles? There's collectibles. We gotta find all the collectibles to get the secret ending. Okay. It's, it's all good. We'll find them. We'll find this. Uh, I feel like this is one of those games that tries really hard with the graphics, but I'm really hoping gameplay is good. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's one of those, like, shiny games that you expect to be really good but i don't know it might it probably is it probably is i don't know we haven't got to the gameplay yet i don't see anything else i can grab can i go in here oh god okay oh that is a weird creepy sound for the flashlight i do see some reused assets though like the the paintings the yeah all that stuff okay so let's turn this light on a clonk all right oh ooh, that gets the, the game super laggy okay so i need to find it now right Okay, 
Oof, God, it's lagging hardcore. Hopefully, I'm not lagging hardcore. Oh, hello. Okay. Uh, I found it. So now what? Whoa. Okay, it's still pretty bright. Do I have to turn the flashlight off? Oh, boy. Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay. Wait, did I die? Oh, did I close my eyes too early? I might have closed my eyes too early. Wait for the right time, Sarah. Oh, okay. Yeah, I get it. You gotta wait for the right time, Sarah. Duh, stupid Sarah. <laughs> stupid dummy. So yeah, this is another reason for me to get um, a, P a better PC. Because when you flick the light on, it starts to lag the game out like pretty hardcore. There he is. Hey, Fran. Oh. Alright, I'm gonna hang out right here. And we can listen for him to come on to give me. Hi. <laughs> oh no, I was, he got too close. I just want to beat the game, okay? want to beat it with all the extras. <laughs> we got this though. How many times do we have to do this? Jesus. Okay. All right, let's find him. Got it. We got it. We're like hella losing frames on this shit, bro. Let's play. I didn't hear him chuckle. Ugh, it's lagging. Hardcore. Holy shit. There he is. Okay. Let me get right here. Whew, man, this game hits the PC hard. Hard. Hello? Hey. Oh. <laughs> Do I need to do the thing? Is he gonna, gonna chuckle? Okay, yeah. Okay, I don't think the light matters. I don't think it matters if you flick the light a second time or not. I think he just does what he wants and he gets weaker every time. So we know it's gonna be soon. <laughs> it's so scary, dude. Like, he can like trip or something. I don't know. He like jumps. He's like back here. There he is. Oh. This is not a good spot. I'm gonna wait right here, dude. Oh. <laughs> oh, oh, oh my god, I'm like preemptively hitting the button. Cause I'm scared. Yeah, you are. Oh. Okay, now we're gonna chill right here. He's close. Oh. <gasps> okay. Where are you at? There he is. He's just chilling. Oh. Hi. Oh. How many times I gotta do this, dude? Oh, oh Jesus. Okay. Oh, hello. Hey, Fran. You okay? Can I do stuff to help you? Can I inventory? Can I use any of this? GDUs. GDUs. G. I can't use. I can't use. I can discard it. Boink. Doop. Okay. I discarded it. And now he's he's still doing the seizure thing. Oh, he exploded. Okay. Was that, was that the game? Hello? Well, that was Raven's Point. Oh, my God. Okay. Um, it just dropped me straight up into this one. <laughs> uh, you got to find the five light bulbs. This one's called Alores or something like that. I don't know. I, was, I expected a title menu. You gotta stay in the- E to collect. Where? What? Oh, it's right there. Okay. Boink. Okay. I need five allure lamps or light bulbs or whatever. So there's a monster in these woods. It chases you. And the only way to avoid it is by going into the light. There's like natural light. And the- Okay. Okay. Is there- Okay. Oh shit. Oh shit. Heartbeat means he's close, right? You don't have a flashlight. Oh, Jesus. What the fuck? Hey. Hey, hey, dude. Okay, um. I seen him. I seen his, uh. Uh, I'm, I'm gonna go. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Ew. 
Wait a minute. That's that free monster. That's that royalty free monster, dude. That's that same monster from like, uh, what was it in? It was in another game. It was like close your eyes or something. This jump scare is about to get me like a motherfucker though. I know the jump scare. It's going to be the same jump scare too. How much you want to bet? I'm just going to run for it. Let's see if I can find some more light. Find some more light. Follow the path. We will find more light bulbs. Probably more light. Two. I don't know. I, I like how the press E pops up. Even if you don't like see it. Oh my god, dude. How does it know where you are? Does it just randomly roam around or? I don't know if this ambiance is a little crazy. Oh, yep, E to collect. <laughs> I didn't even see it. I just saw E to collect pop up on the screen. Gotta listen for the heartbeat. Listen for the beating heart. And that's when we know. We know the beast is near. When we hear the heartbeat. Oh, there's a light. Sweet. Um, so we're safe near the light. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. But we gotta find two more light bulbs. But where? Where though? Like if we find, if we follow the path, will we get them? Do I have to go into the woods to find the light bulbs? Can I fall off? The okay, that's the edge of the map. <laughs> there is a fence. It's pretty cool. I just saw the monster once, and immediately I knew it was the monster for me. Oh, hey, tent. Cool. Oh, shit. It's close. Your boy's really close. Oh, wait, campfire. Campfire counts, right? That's light. <laughs> he was right behind me. Hello. Goodbye. Yeah, you can't get me because I'm in... Dude, he is really fast. Holy shit. And he gone. Let's find some light bulbs. There's one here, right? No. Here, maybe? Oh, hell. Oh, dang. Dude, he's really fast. <laughs> this, is, this is a little ridiculous. Okay. I guess there's not. Look how fast he's going. Damn. Calm down. Dude. <laughs> Go somewhere, all right? Like, <laughs> I don't want to get jump scared. Of course, I don't know what the hell's going on. Oh my god. It's coming right for us! Oh yeah. Stay away. You know there's light right here. I bet he can get you in the light. He's just lazy. I'm gonna go the other way. And hope that he doesn't come up on me. Cause like, he, he fast. He would definitely find me. This place is huge, dude. Where am I supposed to go? Probably just follow the... I'm probably just stupid. I'm dead. He's too He's too fast for me. Yeah, pro I'm probably dead. <laughs> Good God, where? Oh my God. Oh, Jesus. Run. <laughs> I'm about to die. You know what? Wait, does he even kill you? Hold up. Are you going to kill me? Kill me. It's not even a jump scare, you just die. I got to where I was like, meh, fuck it, I don't have to avoid him. Okay, so that's there. Uh, is this there? Is this here too? Yep. Okay. So you get first two basically for free. What about this truck? Are there any on this truck? There, yep. <laughs> I got three right away. Nice. All right, let's go this way. Let's see if there's anything this way. Oh my god, dude. Stop. So if you stay in the trees, you're basically safe. Like, he's not going to get you. Yeah, he gone. That heartbeat gone. I don't know. I feel like it's a good idea. It's a it's a good idea for a game. And obviously, I'm having issues finding the light bulbs. Um, So I can't really be like, this game's too easy. Because, you know, I'm dying. But, uh, but I'm not the best either. Can you pick it up? Thank you. I have no idea where he is, by the way. Is he close? 
What? Well, where is he? Where is that boy? All right, I'm just gonna go this way. I hope he's up. Oh, yep, there. It, that's it. <laughs> Thank you for playing Alori's Alpha Zero. Point. That's what the game's called, Alori's. Next game. All right, this game is called It Devours Our Souls and was made for the Gamers Toolkit Game Jam. It came from another world. Now we are trapped in limbo. Our souls torn apart. Dot, dot, dot. I know you don't have to say that, but whatever. Is there no one brave enough? This is our only chance. Oh, God. The whole screen, like, flashed. Oh, shit. Okay, so this... This is awesome. This is, um... It's for uh, th so the the premise behind this game jam is you can it's it's only one only one enemy only one bullet only one something as long as it has the theme of only one then you good and this one is you got to sneak past the um the monster get to the only gun oh yeah and then one bullet and you got to shoot the monster with it so you got to kill him I want I want to see what he looks like when he attacks me what you look like boy. Oh snap. Oh, here we go. I got him. Wait. <gasps> There's more levels? Sweet. There's only one monster, so I mean... Oh, oh wow. He just sees you and you're dead. This is cool. I like this. Very cool. Very cool. So you have to... You have to hide in the bush. Hiding in the bushes. You can't see me. I am in the bush. Alright, cool. See ya. This ambiance is great, by the way. Dude, this is good. And uh, anyway, I started talking about this last game, but I didn't want to, like, start talking about a totally different game while I was playing another developer's game. And um, this is the one that... Are, oh, it's so cool. A beautiful village is long lost. But anyway, I, I, this is the one that reminded me of Faith when I looked at it because of the, the design, and it's really pretty. There's nothing left. Please find us. Please grant us death. We can't take it anymore. You are our only chance. Oh shit, this is cool. I, dude, this is very cool. And there's different monsters. I'm pretty sure they, they should expand this game. For sure. This is a really cool idea. Like, definitely. <gasps> Did I die? Did he see me? Yeah, I died. Okay, so if they see you at all, you're dead. I like how I'm floating. I'm like a, I'm a ghost. All right, so you got to totally wait for him to turn around. Get in the bush. I'm in the bush. Don't touch me, I'm in the bush. He almost touched me, even though I'm in the bush. I was in the bush, but I got... <laughs> so is that only one monster? <gasps> what? Uh, so yeah, uh, the style of game is fun. I like the pixelated, obviously. I. Actually, actually, all right, get this. I made a plan to make this a three games, one video video just so I can play this game because it looked extremely short. It looked like it was going to be like uh, five minutes long. Got him. Boy, and what? You got to like actually like, oh my God, there's more. <laughs> this is awesome. Uh, okay, okay, okay. I'm going to wait. This way. I'm be greedy. He turning. I'm gonna go over here. Oh, you can't see through the wall, my bo my boy. Me, my dude. Hey, yeah, that was way easier. That monster is bleeding. This is our chance. Finish it, brave soul. We will finally be free. I know I changed his accent like three times, but whatever. You guys know I do that. So, oh, shit. Okay, time for stuff. It's bleeding. We have to follow its blood trail. Wow, 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 wow. <gasps> oh, it's going to be a twist. One bullet. Can I shoot myself with it? What if I miss? Are there two endings? Empty. <laughs> oh, he was blowed. <laughs> the only way you can possibly fail this level and you did it. <laughs> I just wanted to know, because you know these games can have alternate endings. Boom. Thank you.
And that's it. Okay, this one is called Ghost of Tomorrow. Not today. Not yesterday. Tomorrow. So we're going to be going up against a future ghost. And let me just point out that there's no music or ambiance or anything on the start menu. So hopefully there's sound in this game. Hopefully my sound is still working. Is my sound still working? <laughs> yep. <laughs> okay. August 23rd, 2019. Okay. That's not tomorrow, though. That's like two weeks from now. Yes. Hello. Hello. Alice, I've been calling and texting you for two days and you haven't answered. I haven't heard anything from you for days. Where are you? Are you okay? Please call me mom. Okay. Can we call mom? How do, how do we call mom? I don't want to be rude. Okay, so whatever. So no matter where we click on the desk, it just brings the phone up. Um, can I play the guitar? There's a bar on the wall. <laughs> uh, nice TV. The game's skipping around a little bit. Oh, God, Jesus. Okay. But, I mean, it was running okay. You know what? I think it's trying to run it in VR. Hang on. I don't know why Steam VR pops up when I play half these games, but it does. All right, let's open up some door. Is the door going to close? Like after I hear the music, can I close? Can I close myself in the bathroom? Hi. How? Howdy. So I'm gonna be into. What's dripping? Why you dripping, boy? Oh look, it's the painting from Emily Wants to Play too. Or it's the thingy, the painting, the, the whatever. Okay, whatever. Let's go. Okay, so bathroom is scary. Uh, now we know. Scary bathroom time. No, I'm not going in that kitchen. That's the dark hallway. We're going to save that for last. We're going to do the dark hallway last. Because it's the ghost of tomorrow. Uh, the ghost next <laughs> next week is, <laughs> this is a really... Oh, whatever. Okay, whatever. I'm just going to keep commenting on shit in this house. Just judgy as fuck. Just go <laughs> Everything's green. It's not, but whatever. Let's go down the dark hallway. Is a ghost of tomorrow in the bathroom? I think it is. Hello? Okay, no. Nope. Nothing? Okay. I guess that door was locked. That door's locked too. Okay. So we're going to go back to the bathroom now. And probably get scared. Uh-oh. Oh, wait. Is it a poltergeist? Is something open in here? Dude, look at that. It's The lighting's really cool looking. Oh, I see. Okay. Missing person, Alice Graham. Uh, please contact Martha Graham if found. Okay. So uh, that's me probably. Oh, yeah. Last seen outside YN University on August 23rd wearing a white tank top and jean shorts. Brown eyes, dark hair, 5'7", 130 pounds, age 24. Oh. I hear a lady crying and I got a text message from my mom. Hang on. It's still scary. Yep. That's great. That's just what the AC sounds like when you walk into the bathroom. Alice the big, Okay. So um, I heard the text tone, but apparently it's not uh, from my phone. It's from some, this crying lady. Who, is my roommate okay? Like, listen, I know you like to... I know you like to keep your door locked. He's trying to open the door or what? You're just banging your... Why did you do that? Why you close the door? Lock it and then bang your head against the door. It don't make no sense. Oh, wait. Okay, let's try... Uh, let's check the scary bathroom. I want to check the scary bathroom. There's like a, a stain on the on the on the mirror. Okay, whatever. Let's go back to the scary scary hallway door. This is being all crazy and super loud, by the way. I have it turned down a little bit, and it's like, can I open you? Is 
Why are you cr dude? Stop being crazy. Okay, listen, we're gonna have to get a therapist up in here and everything because my roommate, my roommate, needs to calm down. I'm trying to record a video, and you're over, you're in here slamming doors and screaming in your room. Yes, thank you. My God, calm down. Oh, the bathroom door shut. Oh, there we go. Into the scary bathroom. Uh, the door opened by itself, so I'm assuming it's going to close by itself. Okay. The Silver Herald, missing student found brutally murdered. Oh my god, that is... <laughs> it's a lot of reading. Okay. Brutally murdered by roommate. Roommate confesses murder. Alice Graham, a 24-year-old master's degree student who was missing since... August 23rd was found brutally stabbed and killed. Alice Graham's roommate, 25-year-old Gail Rogers, the one screaming in the bathroom, was arrested yesterday as he confessed to committing the murder. Alice was majoring in film while living in a two-bedroom shared apartment with Rogers, who was ma current, also majoring in film near Wyman University campus. <gasps> Martha Graham, Alice's mother, noticed the police, uh, notified the police her daughter was missing after she had not answered her phone in two days. I went to her apartment. Gail said he didn't know where she was, said Martha Graham. Okay. Uh, police searched uh, Mr. Rogers' bedroom after the confession. The body of Alice Graham was found in the cross space hidden uh, behind a false wall inside the closet of Mr. Rogers' room. Uh, police informed that the corpse had chunks of skin sliced off with a knife. Oh, my God. A uh, police officer said this was a very disturbing crime. Alice's unnamed friend informed the press... Alice always told me about Gail's anger issues. He had a temperament, but Alice would always calm him down. Alice Graham's friend also informed that Alice and Rogers were really good friends. They were constantly talking about films and movies. I think Alice was Gail's only friend. Martha Graham informed the press, I always knew there was something weird about Gail. Some, something told me he was involved in her disappearance. Now my baby's gone. I should have done something to avoid this. Mr. Rogers' family remembers, uh, wait, family members did not provide him information, did not provide information of him. Rogers was currently working at a computer repair shop. His co-workers described him as a really smart person, but also adding he was bizarre too, not much of a talker. Police found no previous convictions in Rogers' records. Rogers was charged with first-degree murder and will face court soon. Apartment building where Alice Graham was murdered. Okay, so it is my roommate. He's crazy, and I'm thinking I'm the ghost. Uh, and this is tomorrow, currently. And I'm about to walk up on my dead body. Oh! But we was found in a crawl space, though. This ain't a crawl space. Maybe I was murdered in the bathroom. That's why I'm hearing the scary music upon walking in. Oh! Is that me? What's up, girl? You gonna run at me? I'm ready. Mm. Hello? <laughs> Nice, that was good. I like that. Dude, this is nice. This is actually really cool. <gasps> Hi. This is cool. This is cool. I like this. This this is atmosphere, dog. Dog homie Gio. I'm sorry. I've been saying dog a lot because I'm about to get a new dog and I'm really excited. <gasps> Thank you for playing Ghost of Tomorrow, Jim. That was good. Uh, I like that. That was really cool. That was a hell of an atmosphere. But I guess that is it. Time to quit. <laughs>